Hi, this is David with Organic Themes, and I'm going to teach you how to set up the adventure theme for WordPress.com from scratch. So here you can see we have the demo up for the adventure theme, and we're going to work to set up our website to look similar to this, so that we have the featured slideshow up top, and we have a bio section and some posts down here. Now. If you're just getting started with a brand new theme on WordPress.com, you probably don't have any content yet. So it, it might look something like this. You might have the sample Hello World post displaying and the sample banner for the theme. But we want it to look more like our demo, so we're going to start by adding some content. Now first we're going to add some pages. So we'll go to all our pages here. You can see we have a sample page. Let's add a home page. Now the home page is unique because it doesn't require any content in order to set it up. We just need to add a title and then we're going to go over here to the page attributes and we're going to choose the home page template and then we're going to publish this page. That's all we need to do for the home page. We don't need to add any more content to it. And then let's add a few more pages as an example. We'll add an about page. Now this page, I'll add some sample content. And we're going to add a featured image. So if you go over here to your page settings, you can choose a featured image. I've already uploaded some featured images here. So I'm going to choose this one for my about page. And I'm going to choose a different page template for this one as well. I'm going to choose the featured image page template. This will make sure that the featured image displays as the banner for the page. Okay, that page has been published. And let's just kind of repeat this process for a couple more pages here. The blog page is similar to the home page. We don't need to add content to this page, so I'm just going to go ahead and publish this page as well. And now let's add a contact page. Some default content, and I'm going to add a featured image to this page as well. And we'll publish this page. So now if we go to all pages here, we can see that we have five pages total, including our sample page. Now we we probably want to make sure that we have a, a menu set up here that we can order and arrange the way we want to. So in order to set up a menu of our navigation menu for our new pages, we're going to go to Appearance, Menus, and then we're going to create a new menu. Call this Main Menu. Created. We don't need this custom link, so we're going to move this one. I'm just going to rearrange the order of these menu items, and we're going to choose the uh, choose the location here for the header menu. Save this menu. Now you can see home, about, blog, sample, contact. When I refresh our page over here, those menu items should appear in that order. So we have home, about, blog, sample, contact. Perfect. Next, we want to make sure our home page is set up as our home page for the site here. So currently, it's just displaying our blog. It's displaying the Hello World post, but we want it to display the home page. So we'll go to Settings, Reading. Your home page displays. It's currently set to display your latest post. We're going to change this to the home page. And the post page, which will be the equivalent of our blog, we're going to choose the blog. Save those changes. Now if we refresh this, we see nothing is here yet because we have to have posts in order to be displayed on the home page, but we don't have any posts published yet. So we're going to go to posts, add new, and similar to the pages, I'm just going to create some sample posts. So this one we'll call packing for my big trip. Going to add a featured image for this one as well. 
let's choose this one. Now I'm also going to choose some categories for my post as well. I'm going to create a new category here called Featured. And I want this to show up in my slideshow, so I'm going to add a tag here, which I will later come back to, but we're going to call this tag Slider. I'm going to publish this page. I'm going to repeat this process for a few more posts, so bear with me. this post to be featured in my slideshow as well. So I'm going to add that tag slider. I'm going to publish it. Add a new page. This one I want to display in the slideshow as well, so I'll add the slider tag again. I also want some additional text to show up in the slideshow. So if we look at our demo over here, you can see that we have this text beneath the, the post title here displaying as well in the slideshow. So if you want to display that text, we need to add an excerpt. So I'm just going to add a couple sentences, paste it in there. A little too much. Do that. We'll publish this one as well. Now, when I refresh the page, we're not going to see anything yet because we need to set up this these these posts to display within our theme options. So we're going to go to the WordPress customizer. Now we're going to go to the theme options, and for the home featured page, I'm going to choose the about page that we created earlier. Okay, now our profile section is displaying here with the featured image we added to that page. I'm also going to add a logo. I've already uploaded a logo for this, so I'll go ahead and choose my logo and it displays in place of the site title there. And uh, for the home news category, I'm just going to choose the blog category. Now for the social media links, Normally you would add a link to the actual social media profile, but I'm just going to add these, these null examples for now. Next we want to display our slideshow. So, I'm sorry, here let's go back here and choose to show the home news section. So let's select that option and now our posts that, we, that have the blog category applied are now displaying on the home page. Go. Okay, now we want our slideshow to display as well. So we're going to go back in the customizer here and we're going to go to featured content. And remember that tag we were applying to our posts earlier. I'm just going to add it here slider. And just like that, we have those posts displaying in our slideshow. 
So you can see within a few minutes here we have set up the home page for the adventure theme. I'm going to publish these changes. We're going to go over here to our site which looks very bland and dull and refresh it. Now we have our featured posts, we have our about page, and we have our blog post displayed on the home page as well. If you go to our other pages, go to the about page here, you can see we have the featured image that we applied to this page displayed as well. So if we go to our pages within the WordPress admin, the about page, you can see the featured image here that is displaying here. And the blog page should also be displaying our posts as well. And there you have it. That's a basic example of how to set up the adventure theme for WordPress.com.